Hey guys, Doug Kern here for Searcher Sport Fishing and Fisherman's Landing Tackle Shop. And one of the things that's fun to do on a long range trip that you don't get a chance to do very often is go calico bass fishing. There's some world class calico fishing down the beach and I want to make sure that you're prepared to be able to fish the artificials. If you look at the, the arrangement here, the two main ways are going to be surface iron, which is my favorite way, and plastics. And anywhere from that four inch to eight inch either surface iron or the plastics is what you want to fish with. You're going to want to pay attention to what the birds are doing. You'll also see the calicos flipping around. A lot of times you're in kelp beds and you'll see down at one end the birds will be kind of hovering over where the calicos are and you'll see them chase the bait up every once in a while they flip. You want to make your casts onto those areas where the bass are going to be. Now this uh, surface irons, these are lightweight jigs so you've got to use a star drag reel and a long rod, maybe eight, nine, ten foot like that. This type of stuff, the plastics, we use anywhere from seven foot six to eight and a half foot rods. Nice little level wind reel like that. You can use spectra or monofilament. Something you can cast about a, a three quarter to one ounce to maybe one and a half ounce uh, lead head and uh, plastic lure like that. You need to get the, the jig away from the boat, you know, as far as you can, but the calicos will be within, you know, 30, 40 yards of the boat most of the time. And if you do things right, you might get real lucky. You might end up with a nice trophy calico like that. So enjoy the calico fishing on your long range trip.